Good morning, collective. We're going to do a quick energy check. See what your ancestors, the universe, the divine want you guys to know as you're navigating through your journey, ascending to your highest good. I've already called in the appropriate protection. This is a timeless reading. It's whenever it finds you. <sighs> collective, collective, collective. You know, I love being honest, straightforward with you guys. Um, I went through a little tower yesterday. Everything's good though. Everything is good. Um, I was just sitting here as I was shuffling and meditating, thanking my ancestors for for having my back and asking them for strength at this time. And this card came out immediately. This is the two of cups. What I got is that they'll never be away from you. Your ancestors will always be right by your side, holding your hand, giving you that strength, pouring in that magic. So some of you guys may have experienced maybe a little tower. Maybe some of you guys are calling in your ancestors to, to keep you guys strong during this time. Um, and this is the card that came out. Let's see what Spirit wants us to know. The Two of Cups. Clarify this Two of Cups. What else? Ancestors of the Highest White Light. Archangel Michael. I ask that you please come down and keep me protected spiritually and on earth as I open myself to get these channel messages from Ancestors of the Highest White Light. Only of the Highest White Light. Nothing other but the Highest White Light. Please and thank you. Yeah. Somebody has gained some kind of clarity about a situation that had them in this, the Five of Pentacles. The Five of Pentacles could represent poverty, financially left out in the cold, um, worry, isolation, financial loss. Um, somebody has gained clarity about who these people were that had them in this energy. Nine of Pentacles. The Nine of Pentacles is usually, when I look at this card, it's like a single energy. Somebody who's single, building up their pentacles. I feel like whatever truth and clarity that came out about this, you being in this energy, you got some kind of clarity. Your ancestors came down and showed you something. And I feel like whatever, who, what, whatever this situation is, you're releasing it mentally. And you're getting yourself in this Nine of Pentacles energy, single, building up your pentacles. Somebody's focused on their pentacles right now. So we want you to know that they have your back. They're right beside you. Yeah, manifestation. Somebody's going from the Five of Pentacles, feeling financially lost, to feeling financial gain. Solo pleasure, sufficient, luxury, single, independent. I just heard from bags to riches. That's what I just heard. From bags to riches. connection you were in that you gained some kind of clarity about. Page of Cups, uh, maybe a new connection 
page. Um, some kind of new love, something I'm hearing, not even, not even a year you've been with this person. This is a new connection. connection you felt unfulfilled you felt unfulfilled so you went from the four to the five yeah so the two of wands taking action making a decision making a decision Time to go, I'm hearing. It's time to go. Make sure you guys are giving the video a thumbs up, hitting that subscribe button, clicking the all bells button, commenting if it, if it resonates. This is about this is about your finances are about to go up. You making that decision to work on yourself and work on whatever this is. This is a solo job I'm hearing. From the four, four of cups, five of pentacles, eight of pentacles to the nine of pentacles. Whatever this this connection was. It wasn't, it wasn't serving your highest good. It was blocking you from opening this door, I'm hearing. It kept you sitting here, but you have the key to just open the door. Spirit wants you to walk away from this situation, collective. Hold on. Yeah. I feel like Spirit wants you to walk away from this person. Because whoever this person is, they put you in this gray cloud when you're supposed to be in this flamingo, beautiful, clear sky. This person makes you sit in between, guessing, wondering. Partnership, friendship, relationship, family, jobs. This could be different for everyone. Yeah, because Spirit is about to exchange gifts with you. They need you to open up space so that they could exchange these gifts with you. 
chance you can have this new life. This new life is what awaits you. You're happy, happy. Somebody got true with themselves. Yeah, this is involving like a home connection. Somebody got real with themselves and said, uh-uh, gotta go. Clarify this in-between worlds. Clarify this in-between worlds, please, and thank you, ancestors of the highest white light. Yep. Once you pass that, once you make the decision to get out of this in-between worlds, and take that last step in here, this is what awaits you. Ace of Pentacles, Four of Wands. Oof. I said Spirit wants to be yeah, honest. Surrender it. Surrender it wholeheartedly. Mind, body, and soul. Surrender it. And allow your ancestors, your ancestors, your higher self, and you to celebrate. This may be a connection. I see you releasing this. I see you letting it go. You're sitting there like, this is doing more harm to me than good for me. This is putting me in lack energy versus putting me in abundant energy, creative energy, manifesting energy. This is taking more for me than what I'm, than what, than it's taking more. It shouldn't be taking more. It should be adding to and press. Look at you. It should be creating. It shouldn't be taking away from me. Set boundaries with these people. Yeah, listen to your intuition, High Priestess. Listen to your intuition, High Priestess. Stop it. connection whatever this is for you guys all it was doing was putting you guys in the five of, of wands competition fighting conflict challenges obstacles I feel like this person was thinking about how to fuck with you like that how can I become an obstacle look at this person how can I how, how can I Knock this person off their high horse. Look at them knocking knocking this person down. These are supposed to be friends and family, but look at what they're doing. They're pulling each other down just to get to there. That's some crazy shit. You're supposed to be in the spotlight. You are a star, and this person is blocking whatever this is for you. Some of you guys may be praying to your ancestors, asking them to help guide you. Spirit said, we're going to help guide you. We got your back. Surrender this. Surrender this. Allow us to lead you. Whatever this is for you, 
It could be different for everyone. This is a general reading. But some of you guys have been praying to your ancestors. And they're like, surrender it. Release this person. Get real with yourself. Get single. And put in the work on whatever this creative idea is. Because whatever this is, Spirit is about to bless you once you walk away. Amen. Amen. Yeah. <laughs> Spirit is about to bless you. Here's your justice, man. This is your justice. Spirit is about to make sure that you're good. Simplify your life. Get in that full energy and take the steps you're being guided to take and walk away. Mm -hmm. Uncovering the treasure within you. This person has, has boggled you down too long. Beneath the surface lies a great bounty. I feel like this person didn't want you to see who you were, the worth, your, your ability, your potential. Yeah, solitude and silence, peace prevails. I feel like in you, when you're by yourself away from this person, you get those intuition downloads. You hear spirit telling you, this is not for you. And you know it. You know it. Once they make this decision to walk away from this, Spirit said everything is going to be smooth sailing after this. This is what I got for you guys. Love and light. 